today we're gonna play a game called Laser Cutter versus 3D Printer, in which I will design the same thing for both a 3D printer and a laser cutter and see which one turns out better. Today's challenge, a pencil holder for my pencils on my desk. Now, I knew it would have to be square because laser cutters can only cut flat things, so I'm kind of limited on the shapes I can make. Fusion 360 is very nice because I can design the line drawings for the laser cutter and then simply extrude them to make it printable in the 3D printer. I designed it for 1 8 inch wood, so originally I just extruded it up 1 8 inch, but then I realized that was silly because the whole point of a 3D printer is you can print it in one part. First, I started my 3D printer with some ABS on the first design. This was gonna take a while. Then I started lasering the wood I needed. The nice thing about laser cutting is that it goes pretty fast. Unless, of course, your machine decides to cut out things in a weird order like mine was. So I got them all lasered. Sanded it down, glued it together, stained it, put some polyurethane for shine, and came back and the other one was still printing. I had to let the stain finish drying anyways, so I left and came back to find both finished. And they look pretty cool. The wood one turned out decently. There are some uneven spots because I didn't get all the wood glue off before I started staining. All the cuts, however, came off very clean. The 3D printed version had a little bit of trouble on the steeper angles, but overall it did a really good job. Which one is better? Well, it's really up to you, but I like the 3D printed one but that's just because I didn't have to do any finishing work on it. Depending on what you want, one method might be better than the other. If I hadn't stained the wood or cut it out of acrylic, it would have been way faster to use the laser cutter. And on the plus side, now I have two pencil holders. 